Hey there, Psych2Goers. Have you been overwhelmed with stress lately? Like the kind of stress that's adding and adding up, getting ready to explode? This feeling could be a warning sign of an impending mental or nervous breakdown. This is a scary experience that makes it impossible for you to cope and function in your everyday life. So to help you identify some of these warnings, here are eight early signs to look out for. Number one, you are more irritable. Are you finding that you're on your last nerve lately? When you're on the verge of a nervous breakdown, even small things like someone being a little too late or walking a little too slow can put you over the edge. This can happen even if you're not a hot-headed person. Suddenly, you just can't help yourself but to feel intense anger at everyone and everything. Number two, you worry about everything. Is your mind just cluttered with worries about everything? When you're nearing a mental breakdown, you may notice that your anxiety is off the rails. While it's normal to worry about things now and then, it becomes a problem if you're finding that you worry from sunrise to sunset or that it's affecting your ability to do the things you love. This can quickly become a cycle that spirals out of control. Number three, you withdraw from friends and family. When stress eats you up, talking to someone you trust is a good self-care strategy but oftentimes it just seems too difficult to hang out with anyone. You may start to feel like all you wanna do is get away from people and spend as much time as you can alone in your bed. Talking to others may make you feel exhausted and you may keep canceling plans, making up excuses for staying home or just plainly ignoring anyone who tries to talk to you. This is a sign that you're reaching your breaking point and the isolation may further add to your problems. Number four your appetite has changed. Feeling intense stress can change your appetite. Are you noticing that you're forgetting to eat? Or when you do eat, that it makes you feel sick to your stomach? Or are you finding that you're not interested and things just don't seem to taste as good as it once did? Or on the other hand, you may indulge in overeating as a way to cope with stress. You may crave food that you know is unhealthy more than usual. While your eating habits can have drastic impacts on your physical health, it also affects your mental health as well. Number five, you sleep too much or too little. How have you been sleeping lately? Do you have trouble falling or staying asleep? Or maybe you're sleeping more than usual? Insomnia is another common symptom of mental breakdown. Difficulty falling asleep or waking up several times during the night is not only frustrating, but it can also worsen your other symptoms. On the other hand, sleeping too much, known as hypersomnia, can also be a problem as well. Despite those extra hours, you may find that you're still feeling sluggish. Sleep, like most things in life, needs a balance. Number six, you're finding it difficult to focus and remember. Have you noticed that you're blanking out more? Maybe you're always looking for your keys and can never remember the time of your next appointment. Do you also find it hard to focus? You try to work or listen to someone speak, but your mind is wandering. Long-term stress can impact your brain's physical structure. The stress hormone, cortisol, that your brain has too much during this time makes it difficult for you to stay on top of your game. If left unchecked, it can increase these problems later. Number seven, you're losing your energy and motivation. When you take all the not sleeping, not eating, and excessive worrying into account, you might feel like you're driving on an empty tank. You may find that it's harder and harder to find the point in doing anything, which kills your motivation. Fatigue can make it difficult for you to function normally, dropping your quality of life. This excessive tiredness can be an early sign of a mental breakdown and one of the more severe ones. And number eight, you have difficulty breathing. Are you finding yourself needing to catch your breath more? According to a study published in a respiratory medicine journal, there is a strong link between stress and respiratory symptoms. During periods of intense stress, your body is trying to prepare itself to run away or fight for its life. This mechanism called fight or flight response may sometimes manifest itself as a shortness of breath. You may feel like you're barely able to catch your breath, suffocating, hyperventilating, or having a tightness in your chest. Of course, shortness of breath can also be linked to other problems. So if you're finding this problematic, it's best to make an appointment with a healthcare provider.
Feeling your mind and body giving up under all the pressure is extremely tough. It's important to know, however, that you're not alone and getting help is possible. Making an appointment with a healthcare provider or mental health professional is a great first step to getting your health, both mental and physical, back on track. Similarly, taking small steps at home, like improving your eating habits, getting a regular sleep schedule, and reaching out to loved ones or faith leaders can help you in your journey as well. We hope you were able to find this video helpful. Remember to subscribe to Psych2Go and turn on the notifications to keep up with our upload schedule. Let us know your thoughts on this video in the comments below. Take care.